My name is Jess Johnson. I'm a New Zealand-born artist based in New York. I've been drawing this science fiction universe for the last several years. The idea of being able to manifest your own reality is what I'm trying to do with building this universe in my drawings. I'm really influenced by science fiction. I read a lot of science fiction when I was younger and still it's mostly what I consume. My mum is a quilt maker and growing up she was always making quilts in the background. I think that really sunk into my consciousness. I've begun to realise the influence that her quilt making had on my own artwork. My name is Alex Davies. I'm the chef and owner of Gatherings Restaurant in Christchurch. Gathering started as a response to me wanting to engage the wider public in a conversation in and around food. It really came to me when I was working on an organic vegetable farm, weeding onions by hand and wanting to show the dedication and the hard work that these people put into honouring and respecting the land for future generations. Over time the world's become much more complex and there's this architecture and social hierarchy and relationship between these alien deities and humanoid figures which has emerged. The world gets built on the page so it's like the drawings are the building blocks of the universe. Once they're created they get turned into all these other types of mediums. I think the way that I think about food is probably filtered through this lens of science fiction and what we might be consuming in these vastly different speculative worlds of the future where food is going to be unrecognisable. I think industrialised food impacts on people's livelihoods because it strips away any human connection to the land. The whole system is broken and it's harmful to not only our planet, but to the individuals that are consuming this. With this collaboration, we've been trying to conceive a post-apocalyptic end-of-the-world menu. Mystery dinner from leftover unlabeled tins, heavily processed food. We wanted to create something that was almost unrecognisable as food, so far removed from what we know as food today and looking at an absolute worst case scenario in which everything is lost and we are dependent on the last remnants of the industrialised food. I think the way food is going is that people are becoming more conscious and wanting to be more in tune with where their food is coming from. Where I get my energy from as an artist is probably from my own company. I think everyone develops an art practice to suit their psychology, so I've developed this very labour-intensive practice of drawing where I have to spend long hours in a studio thinking my own thoughts. What I would suggest to a younger artist is get comfortable with your own company because you'll be spending a lot of time by yourself.